Philadelphia, of course, coming off a rough year of 28 wins, Ron. 14th best record in the West. Or in the Let East, pardon me, and Philadelphia Let's scores first. Bucket. And guess what? Fultz. First bucket, Mark L. Fultz. Yeah, nice up and under move there. Got the defender up in the air. Jalen Brown is one of the few guys that has a little NBA experience out there on the floor. You know, Ron went surrounding Brown and then Luau for Philly. Those are guys are equally important to the well-being of their franchises in a lot of ways. Philly collapses defensively on the baseline. Drew runs the break down the baseline, and that ball is up and good. Nice shot. It has some NBA experience. 19 games overall. Yeah, you can see it. it's six foot six. It, this both teams want to run the floor. What a move! That's a great move. Number Graham. The players, he's, as young as they are, Craig. I mean, they're just getting to the point where they just can do it all at such a young age. Accomplish something like that. Very, very few. Fultz, by the way, impressive in the early going. Five quick points, a jumper to start, and a three ball to, to finish. Scored the big band. 6'11". He has high energy, and he's got great foot speed, guys, for a, for a big man at 6'11". Long, and, and how do you, how do you, you know, get that winning attitude now to the point where it really bothers you when you, when you, when you lose? <laughs> the winning brand, which they believe they're doing, and they believe the foundation now is 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 in place and is being nice. built brick by brick. Came folds along with Jalen Brown and, and Tatum. They look calmer than I thought, playing in really in front of a nice crowd tonight, and Accepting the challenge, and, and I, I get the impression that these young guys have that same mentality that they think that they can be just as good as anyone else. He had a couple of free throws earlier out of Kentucky, joined Philly back in April. He did play six games last year for the 76ers. Loose ball comes out to Drew. Pack game, which allows him to play to his strengths. Nice cut, and he gets two after the free throw. Would you hate to compare anyone to him? But he had a great release, just like Tatum has a great release. And I just get, you know, much shooting and practice and working out with coaches. That is vital, that if you're a two-foot jumper, that's the time it takes to bring that second foot over is just too much in this league that you have to be a one-foot jumper to be good around the rim. By the way, Jabari Bird knows this floor, David. Uh, he had his career high against the University of Utah, the run and use on this floor. He's considered one of the best athletes out of BYU ever. Absolutely. I mean, now, but he was also a professional baseball player as well. Kentucky. His brother played for Memphis last year. Nice cut inside. And a beautiful finish, Kadeem Allen. He's got a 6'9 wingspan. Olajay's out of SMU. He slid a little bit on draft night. I think people had him projected at least during the prospect stage of things much higher than that. Demetrius Jackson back out to Nader. A little bump, no foul. Push shot up. Good right hand. Abdul. You're seeing a lot more of that in the NBA and knocking them off balance and shooting the basketball. Now, he was the D-League Rookie of the Year. He played for the main Red Claws in Boston. Now opens up the floor and up on top of the Jaylen rim Brown. is Jalen Brown. A little crowded in the paint, Ron, and the Sixers turn it over. Here comes Nader again, the big fella, on a kick out three. Oh, my. Out of a net. Saying, hey, look, I was the number three pick last year. A little coming out party here in SLC. Coming right back at you is Fultz. <laughs> Five. No, you can play almost every position in this league. Nice steal. Jackson front court past Briscoe. Nice feet again. And Brown with a circus shot. Jalen Brown having his way here in the first half. And right back at you comes Philadelphia with a flush. You know, and Ron, when you look at the bios of these players, it's amazing. There is basketball. It is worldwide as Drew buries an easy three straight away. Big step. Oh, rejected off the back of the backboard. Petaway, nice feed inside and a one-hander. Whether he feels for him, for his family, which city presents the best fit for him? What do you think the Celtics' biggest selling point to Gordon is? We got you know a couple of decent players, but I, I do think they got a little, they got a little gun shot. They didn't want to wait. Do you? How big a missed opportunity for the Celtics to not use? Poked away, Philly gonna have an easy breakaway too, and Harrison hangs up on that rim and knocks it down. Timeout call. You'll agree, we're both transplants to the state. A geological wonder. Well. We both are from 
three. West. Also, Boston, 22 points in the paint, but the Celtics, when we came out of timeout, missing five straight shots. Boston with the ball, they made just one field goal the last eight minutes. In fact, one at seven, and that's an oh my moment. Way up top, Locke still looking at me as Jason Tatum rocks the rim. Eastern, seven o'clock mountain time. A lot of story lines in Salt Lake City. Of course, we're following what um, Haber's decision will be. Now the Celtics are getting the ball out and they're running. Here it comes again. Fultz with nine. Brown answers back. He's just better than everybody else. This little spin move in traffic. You see more and more players now. They make the spin move. Hi, Ram. Traditionally, from a number standpoint, it's the ball, the shot off the bounce comes after being able to catch and shoot. Most guys can catch and shoot. And the air is a little thinner, and, and the pace they're playing. Oh, Allen went to the rack, and Fultz was there to meet him. That's D. Number seven, Markel Fultz. Beautiful block. And he really catches it right at the right time. By Philadelphia. That's that Bolden. I mean, Philadelphia fans have to just be ecstatic of what they're seeing today. Boston on the run, trying to up the tempo as Jackson leaves it inside and a nice roll-in bucket. Oh my, Jalen Brown. Going to call this foul. Nice move. Harris, and there it is again. I mean, just a lot of upper body movement. Jackson takes the screen, oh. the floor opens, and that's the Boston easiest bucket of the night Andrews. for Boston. Jackson. And a steal. Nader puts it up and in. Two quick buckets. Nader. And the Celtics close the lead late on an 8-0 run. Holtz, 5 of 10, David, from the floor. He's knocked down 11 points, but what's impressive, too, defensively, three block shots as well. That's a second-round pick right there, Ron. Yeah, and, and sometimes guys like that really slide through the cracks. Tatum and one. Jason Tatum. Chips well, on their shoulder. Team. Millsap was one who's now an all-star. They knew the weaknesses of those players. It's the fact that those players found ways to overcome those weaknesses at a rate that nobody anticipated. Yeah, but the Jazz work out about taken. everybody. They do. Yeah. Se 76 guys, David, if you really want the, the number. A bank three. three I haven't seen that. Now we have Mark seen it. <laughs> Fultz with a bank shot three in his pro debut. Under eight minutes left. Nice move. Slides in. Left hand counted. To the big fella. Potras, who's had a nice game. If Philly's not shy, pulling the trigger. That's a three. Miles deep. Rainbow three. Six minutes left. No, you've written a story about it. What what did you find out about that? Well, I talked to him earlier in the day. He, he certainly was... Uh, very intrigued by that job. There's only 30 of those. I'm really looking forward to that Paul George press conference. The good news for you as a ESPN undefeated reporter who lives on the West Coast is you never have to travel ever again. Eight in the fourth quarter, seven straight misses from the floor, 83-83. Tatum now pulls the trigger and nails it. Celtics on top. Big shot, and then watch this between the legs. Pulls the trigger deep on the net. 85 all. That conversation. And it was a beautiful move. Now 19 points for the third overall pick out of Duke. He wants that ball on the block. He's got it, lopped it, hit the rim, and it's back to Boston. Jackson lays it in. Demetrius. Jackson, belt high dribble. Poitras runs after him, blocks that shot away. Beautifully done defensively. Three on two, Philly on the run. Around the rim and out. Oh, baby. The follow up on Chicken. top of the rim. Luau Kamaru. Are they going to go ISO, Booner? Let's see how he does. See what he does here. Tatum pulls the trigger. About a 17 footer. Bang. Big shot on a big stage. Eight of the last 10 points down the stretch, Ron, for the Celtics. Okay, they put the ball in his hands in the closing seconds of a ball game. Let's see what they do with the third pick in the draft. Baseline reversed. Boston collapses. Rebound Celtics. And Boston with the thriller in Salt Lake. Game one in the book.